Hello, welcome back. Any sensory unit possible forfeit. We're not doing any street crimes in this, they're all done. Uh, what we're gonna do <coughs> is go for all the hidden cars. There's one here, which I've already got to, but we'll drive to that one anyway. Uh, so it's gonna be to there. Uh, and hopefully, now I'm actually in the police car, not any other car. I'm going to get um, a trophy for driving 194.7 miles, given that I've got to go all the way across to get all of the question marks that are on the screen at the minute. That's not going to be difficult. At Alvera Street Plaza, unit to handle code 3 identified. So what we're going to do is get the hidden vehicles. Once the hidden vehicles are done, then I'm going to spend a little bit of time going through uh, the car lots just to show you how to go about getting all the rest of the cars that are not hidden. And we'll go from there. For real. They just don't get out your way. No, 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 no. Emergency officer, I need your vehicle. Yeah, because mine's wrecked. So that's how you do that. So GTA, little bit. Take the next left. Any sentry unit possible 415 at Alvera Street Plaza, unit to handle code 3 identified. Nope. That's the ice, ice cold storage lot. I'm not going for the landmarks, but it's nice to get them. Oh, this is where one of the crimes were. Yeah, just trains straight down the middle of the road. Straight through the next intersection. Up ahead, you turn left. Very industrial feeling bit. It's very interesting how different the different parts of the city do actually look. Also needs help. 415 and shots fired, 313, Bunker Hill Avenue, unit to handle code 3, identified. Right, so that's going to be that one. Out the way. A map to this one. 
Okay, so go left at the next one. Take the next left. You're taking the next left. Draw. Oh, it's not the best. It's not bad. I'm just looking at the draw distance of the cliffs in the back. Six Street Bridge. If you've ever watched uh, the movie SWAT, you'll know the Six Street Bridge. KGPL to all units. Citizen reports man with a gun. Union and Rockwood Street. Union and Rockwood Street. Unit to handle code two. Identify. Is there. Interesting car. Wow. Okay. Ick. Let's go for that one. It must be static from the radio, but there's a crackling sound. KGPL to all units. Citizen reports man with a gun. Union and Rockwood Street. Union and Rockwood Street. Get it to handle code 2. Identify. Can you hear that? It's like a crackling sound. Very bizarre. Cole, come on! Not my fault. Oh, man. Sorry, my partner isn't the greatest driver in the world. <laughs> I have a Range Rover, I don't need to be. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
Shots fired, officer down, 6th Street and Lindley Place, 6th Street and Lindley Place, unit to handle code 3, identify. KGPL to any unit, a citizen reports suspicious activity, 111 South Alameda, stand by for further for any sentry unit. If you want to leave that one to the uniforms, that's fine. We've got plenty to get on with. Whoa. Now that's an interesting one. I like the design of that. ATI Radio is a member of the ACB Phantom. American Century Broadcasting. Broadcasting at 760 kilohertz. Ooh, that, that is a... a very nice car. Right around the corner in your name. Wow. Right, where is the next? The next, next one. Yeah, it's just going to be there. Uh, statistics. How far have we driven? 67.25 miles. So 190, so we need to do 135, uh, 130... Units, the citizen reports a 211 in progress at 9th and Grand. Unit to handle code 3, identify. 67, 240, 194. So it's 30 to 190, 7, take off, 4, take off 3, 27.5, yeah 27.5 miles, 127.5 miles. Take it if you want, or not. We're not the only cops in this town. left at the next intersection. I really do like that cinematic camera, it's cool.
think I've driven this one too. Yes. You are listening to Duke Ellington. Get out before the music starts. <laughs> Games like these are YouTubers' nightmares because you just can't stop the music. That's a song. But you really can't. There, there's so much music in this, but it's just, no, you just can't stop it. You can't turn it off, can't turn it down, nothing. Well, you can, but you turn off all of the music associated with the game because it's classed as being that. Calling all cars, citizen reports, officer needs help, shots fired, officer down, 6th Street and Lindley Place, 6th Street and Lindley Place, unit to handle code 3, identified. But coming from Rockstar, Keep on going through here. It's very weird because you've always been able to turn off the music in uh, GTA games. You're taking the next left. Straight ahead. nice. I've always been a fan of cars with trapped wheels. Like, like those. They're, they're kind of cool. Having the trapped front wheel as well is just very weird. Okay, you're gonna do that to me, then we'll quit. All street crime is done. <sighs> Mapski, what have we got to go for next? This one. A long way away. Any sentry unit, possible 415 at Alvera Street Plaza, unit to handle code 3, identify. Keep on going through here. Go right through here. All units also need to help. 211 and shots fired. 391 Broadway, Mallory's Cafe. 391 Broadway, unit to handle code 3. Calling all cars, citizen reports, officer needs help. Shots fired, officer down. 6th Street and Lindley Place. 6th Street and Lindley Place. Unit to handle code 3, identify. If you want to leave that one to the uniforms, that's fine. We've got plenty to get on with. Okay, at the next corner, hang a right. So we got the RKO Theatre. <clears throat> Central unit, car 16 Adam reports a possible jumper at 8th and Hope, the Methodist Church. Gently? Yeah. Are you a citizen? 
Take the next left. Hey, come on! You don't need to turn here. Wasn't my intention. Keep on straight. Derek's in the city. You can stop for me, not the other way around. near the we're not a million miles away from the quarter moon murders site the siren might keep people out of your way what do you think Yeah, but that's too easy. Anyone can use siren. That's a station wagon and a half. Christ of Woody. <laughs> well, yeah. That was water. <laughs> is refreshingly different. It's uh, it's historical, but the cars are well designed. It has the usual. We're going to separate the area up into very distinct looking parts, which you know I know I never really um, understood until I've, I played Assassin's Creed One, uh, and you had uh, Jerusalem, Arca, uh, and. Damascus, yes, uh, and they, they were—they all looked very, very different. Yeah, Jerusalem with its kind of greenish tint, uh, Damascus with its orange sandy tint, and Acre with its almost—I'm going to make it look like it's black and white. But this game does that sort of with. A day night cycle and Whoa there! All units also need help. Two eleven and shots fired. Three nine one Broadway, Mallory's Cafe, three nine one Broadway, unit to handle code three, identify. Also manages to separate this uh, the city out into its relevant parts, which is quite good. You got the downtown area and the less well-built area, like around here, the suburbs. 
which is now not and then you've got the uh, industrialized areas as well so it has that same sort of subdivision of game space while making it all one unified part it's kind of cool I like it A wash. H boy. Just go for the what is that? Canister coupe. Don't know about that one. I'm gonna go for it anyway because it's not. One that I remember driving. Is that noise? I thought I could drive through that bit, obviously I could not. Coming Calm down in here and through. To, it does. Why that's a hidden car, I'll never know. But, okay. KTI radio. It took a torpedo. Five, two, one thing I never really realised, but there is a lot of alliteration in vehicle names, like the Range Rover. Took a tornado. Took a tornado. Vauxhall Vectra. All units in the vicinity in any central unit. A 211 and shots fired 410 South Flower Street. Unit that can handle code 3 identify. find out what that button does because I think I just found the radio shut off. It works. Great. Officer, you need help. 103 and 
Alpha shots fired. Officer down. Sixth Street and Lindley Place. Sixth Street and Lindley Place. Unit to handle code three. Identify. Driven this one before. Yeah. Right. Does the L1 button do it? No. None of them do. That's annoying. You're gonna kill us! No, just someone else. That's a very special car. Wow. That oh, they they oh, they just don't make cars like this anymore. I mean, the modern vehicles and everything with all the fancy dashboards that they've got coming out now, yeah, they're cool, but not like that. You know what, I really wish that someone would come out with a truly retro car design like that with all the modern features that we've got now, the lighter metals, all the different kinds of um, synthetic materials that you can get put into vehicles to make them safer and have all of the mod cons that you should have in a vehicle. Yeah. GPL to all units, citizen reports man with a gun, Union and Rockwood Street, Union and Rockwood Street, unit to handle code 2, identify. So they've actually come up with a name for my generation, uh, those born between 77 and 83. Uh, Generation Xenia, I think it's called. Uh, those that are not Millennials, but not Generation X either. And for those of us that can still remember what it was like without the technology, it's kind of nice to see how some vehicles are now being developed because I mean I can remember uh, watching Night Rider and thinking wow and there are some vehicles now that you... I rent rented a car recently uh, for work to get to a course ladies how often does this happen in and wow hey, it's a three-wheel drive and I swear it had more more tech in than Knight Rider did. Aside from the obvious, it didn't have torpedoes with the ability to turbo, and it wasn't bulletproof. But still, uh, <laughs> it did talk to me. I did feel a special bond. 
between man and car. Help! KGPL to all units. Citizen reports man with a gun. Union and Rockwood Street. Union and Rockwood Street. Unit to handle code 2. Identify. They say that even though my, my Range Rover has a female name, Pamela, the Bluetooth uh, radio connection that I've got, because it didn't come with uh, connection to get the car working properly, unfortunately, uh, it, it's got a dude's voice. It's like the deepest dude's voice as well. <laughs> Kind of sad that I don't have the option to turn it into a female's voice, so it would literally be as though Pamela was talking to me. Uh, that would be nice. I've also figured out uh, just recently why whenever whenever I've watched an American TV show or um, movie and the actors stop the car, engage the parking brake, and I think that they've done everything that they do, the car shakes. And by shakes, I mean rocks backward and forward. Uh, I've never really driven an automatic before, but I've... So, not sure if that actually carried over. But yeah, I don't. Uh, I never really understood why in uh, American movies, when an actor stops a car from moving, the the car rocked backwards and forwards. It's because they don't apply the handbrake. They literally just put it in park and the car rocks backwards and forwards. I know that now because my car's automatic and that's what mine does. But I never knew that before because with being a manual car driver, stick shift, uh, you put the car in neutral, you have to put the handbrake on, otherwise it just stops moving. But with park, you don't need to. And it's also why in English um, TV series or anything like that, you never come across anyone on a UK oh, and steady, come on. TV program or movie ever that has a car and an issue with its, with losing the handbrake. Cool. Or cars rolling away. The only time that ever happens in the UK is if it's too frozen. Because it obviously looks like in America, you guys don't put the handbrake on. You just rely on the parking brake. KTI Radio, a service of the American. And if you do that, you're screwed. Straight down the road. Alright, continue to respond, okay? All units to citizen reports of 211 in progress at 9th and Grand. Unit to handle code 3, identify. Give me a break! Near there. Once I've done this, getting the other eighty five is relatively easy. For the most part. There are some which will require a, uh, a cheeky little finagle 
and some that just won't, which is useful. Watch it, will you? If you use the siren, maybe those metal things in front of you called cars will know you're in a hurry. Unit. A 211 has shots fired, 410 South Flower Street. Unit that can handle code 3 identified. Oh, that's, that's a nice car. And the wheels are trapped. All four wheels are trapped. Oh, that's lovely. It just, they just don't make cars like that anymore. It's so sad. So, so sad. Alright, get on this right, don't turn off it. Wow. But the other ones, it's just a matter of going around the car parks and going to... into one or two missions to pick them up. Breathe, Phelps. Breathe, damn it! But yeah. Car parks. A lot of them. But uh, to get the Miles on the Clock trophy, uh, you also need to pretty much not let your partner drive. It doesn't count. Watch where you're driving, you maniac! I need a police car. I need a police car. Ah! I need a police car. Is there a game ball nearby? Oh, but there's a police car there. Phelps, that's 1247. I need this car. Come on, Rusty. Nice new car. Calling all cars. Citizen reports. Officer needs help. Shots fired. Officer down. 6th Street and Lindley Place. 6th Street and Lindley Place. You have to handle code 3. Identify. <laughs> It was a nice new car, it is not anymore. If we survive this, it's going to be a miracle. That's all the hidden cars, I believe. Let's have a look. Statistics. 20 of 95, okay. Does it say vehicles? Uh, vehicles common dead to women shots on target. No, nothing about the 
Quite miscellaneous. No. Right, map. Any question mark? No question marks at all. Cool. Right. Next on the agenda is to get the rest of the cars. So we've got two door, two, three, about oh, 25 of these. of these <coughs> so Plymouth we've got Service. Okay. Bonus. Oh, that's all the the hit ones. So we need to get all the two doors and the police cars. Right, so let's have a look at We shall get those next time. So thanks for watching me do the hidden vehicles. We'll get on to doing the other collectibles, which are cars, unfortunately. Get these out of the way, then we'll get on to doing the rest. So I'll see you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.